The Conservatives are for devolution, but only devolution motivated by the desire to empower small local communities and not by petty jingoistic nationalism. This video looks at devolution done right. Westminster carries out some activities in England which could be better done by local communities. Some areas in England have very strong local feeling and have councils that wish to collaborate more and carry out Westminster's activities better. These include transport, home building and jobs. These councils apply to the government for a bespoke devolution deal that is specific to their area and if the government accepts, a mayoral combined authority is set up. This has happened in Manchester, the West Midlands, the West of England and others. Broadly, it has been a success as it provides a strong leader who is directly accountable to the electorate. The Conservative government is committed to seeing that more of these MCAs are created so regional inequality can be reduced. The levelling up white paper released in February 2022 has this to say. We want to usher in a devolution revolution. By 2030, every part of England that wants one will have a devolution deal. And we will open negotiations on trailblazer deeper devolution deals with the West Midlands and Greater Manchester combined authorities. The levelling up paper also features commitments to opening tariffless freeports, and it will be exciting to see how local empowerment progresses. This type of devolution for city regions compares favourably to devolution for Wales and Scotland, which has been divisive and continues to threaten a disastrous breakup of the UK. In particular, it could provide capable leadership for Edinburgh and Glasgow, which have suffered due to the SNP government's failures on education, crime and drug deaths. Conservative Mayor of the West Midlands, Andy Street, is a sign of the success of Metro Mayors. In his first 100 days in office, he set up Ask Andy Sessions, a mayor's mentor scheme teaching youth skills, and spoke with Theresa May. Let's hope there's more like Andy. In conclusion, mayoral combined authorities are a bottom-up solution that empowers local communities to address inequality. Crucially, they are voluntary and not enforced by government, but set up on local areas' own initiative. 